Welcome to YouTube channel please subscribe now for get breathing exercises. What General Hospital Mall Carly Corinthos needed on the day that she brought into the world her first little girl was an escape plan. At a birthday party for her ex-husband Sonny Corinthos' latest wife Claudia Zachara, the mobster revealed to one and all that he now knew she was responsible for the shooting that had put his and Carly's son Michael in a coma. Well aware that that meant her next pair of shoes would be cement, not designer, Claudia took a very pregnant Carly hostage at gunpoint and drove off into the night. Before you could say, ah, nuts. Claudia had lost what few marbles she had left. Carly knew that she had to do something if she was going to get herself and her unborn child out of this fix alive. So she grabbed the steering wheel and crashed the car. Risky, yes, hella, but it worked. She emerged unharmed and toddled off to a nearby cabin where she lit a fire and, heaven help her, prepared to give birth. Of course, the collision had only left Claudia unconscious, not dead. So she soon made her way to the cabin, where she helped Carly usher Jocelyn into the world. Which seemed nice-ish and all, but having gone bat guano crazy, Claudia believed that the tyke was the one she'd miscarried and intended to leave with the, in her mind, her, baby. Though Wright had already slayed as Ali Rescott on Loving in the City, not to mention rocked her guiding light role, she wasn't cocky. I showed up every day ready to kick ass, but as far as feeling like, haha, it's mine. I've made it. I've never felt that, she said during a Michael Fairman TV interview. Instead, she watched as much as she could of her predecessor's work, because, I did want to honor all the fans and what they loved about Carly, she mentioned to Digest.